some new products that I'm going to be adding to my shop very shortly um, so these are products that I've never had before in my store it's the first time I'm going to be seeing them so we're going to find out at the same time pretty much uh, what they're like so they actually just arrived over the weekend and I've been looking at the box all weekend I've been like itching to open it but I thought it would be fun to open it on camera just because it would be fun like I think it's interesting watching these so anyway so by the time you're watching this these things will probably already be on my store so they'll be available to purchase um, yeah so I don't think I'm forgetting anything I guess we'll just get into the unboxing uh, okay uh, how do I do this this is the box it's filled with lots of goodies Ah, I'm so excited. I think I might just leave it on the floor and pull them out as I go. everything that I've ordered so this is very exciting what's in box number one I've got two boxes here so <laughs> I'm so excited designs I chose to begin with. They're so cute! Okay, so this is the first one. This is my busy doing nothing drawing. So they have the illustration on the front, they're blank on the inside just because it's easier that way. You can literally use it for anything you want. Uh, and then on the back it's just got with love, Juanita, illustrations by Nita aka Juanita and then my website. So these are A6 and when you order them they will come with these little uh, envelopes. I forgot the exact description of them but you could like pick if you wanted a white one or a, I don't know but I picked these ones. 
yeah, so that's the first one. Ooh. Can you see that? The second one. This is my Nima. So I named it Nima because this is a picture of my mum and my youngest baby and it was my mum meeting her for the first time so I drew her I drew this on my 30 day challenge during my 30 day challenge I think it was day 28 or something so it's the same it's just got the picture on the front the details on the back and then blank inside so these are really cute I feel this illustration is really cute for like a I don't know, like if someone was to have a baby or a baby shower or it's just very maternal. I love it, it's so cute. Okay, so there's those. Another one, it's another mother and baby one, but it's a mouldy one. So this is one of my original drawings before I even like started my business. This was the second drawing for my business I ever did and it's a photo, uh, it's a drawing based off a photo of me and my daughter but I've obviously put us in Māori attire. This is the mama print, same deal, inside back the same. I think all the back of them are the same colours, yeah. So that's the mama card, greetings card. Oh, there's only three. No, I'm sure I did more than three. No, let me just pull all of these out. Maybe I did just do three. I think if this is all of the greetings cards, it was something else I was thinking about. Those are the greetings cards. I thought I did more, but I'm remembering now. Oh, because when you upload your artwork for them to be like made into these products, um, you have to like make sure it's all the right. What's the word? Like dimensions and format and things like that. So I thought I did more, but I'm thinking about how I was on Photoshop doing other stuff. So that's what I'm about to open. Okay, so I got some more vinyl stickers. So at the moment you know that I have four different vinyl stickers. Two of them sold out faster than the other two. So I reordered two. The ones that ran out, I reordered some more of those ones. Plus I ordered two more designs. So I restocked on two existing ones and I ordered two new ones. So now my total grand total of vinyl stickers is six designs. But because the first two designs that ran out a little while ago, uh, the other two that I ordered at the same time, they're starting to run out now as well. So that's annoying. Um, I'll just order some more soon. But in the meantime, this is them. So the ones that were more popular than the other ones was the Grace and the Cora stickers. So I just ordered some more Grace ones and I ordered some more Cora. Two. I was going to see if they were exactly the same as my last ones, but they're all sold out, so I can't compare. <laughs> but yeah, so these are the vinyl stickers. They're really, really good quality, I have to say. I've got them on my laptop, and yeah, they're amazing. And the, the, the dimensions at their either tallest or widest point, they're 10 centimeters. So they're a decent size. So that's those two. Then I have the South Love Club 
illustration that I did in my 30 days of drawing so I've just made that into a vinyl sticker. This is one of my favorite illustrations just because it's so cute like the fun thing about drawing is being able to make your little things that you're drawing wear whatever you want and I just randomly felt like putting her in black and white pants the day that I drew it and it just turned out really cute <laughs> in my humble opinion and the fourth design because I did get a few requests it's to be honest it's not going to be for everyone just because not everyone is from New Zealand but it is another Māori one and it is the Papa illustration that I did in my 30 day challenge which I made into a print I made into a hoodie I got my sample hoodie it arrived a few days ago so I, I'll insert a photo it's not the best photo because my husband just wanted to chuck it on and wear it <laughs> so yeah that's that and now it is a vinyl sticker so that's very cute oh and it's also a decal for your car so those are the vi the new vinyl stickers also I just ordered some more what is going on here some more thank you stickers because yeah I ran out these are just paper stickers I put on my packaging If you've ordered from me, chances are you've had one attached to your order. But, yeah, just the thank you stickers. Ah, this is... Ooh. These are the things that I am very excited about. Okay, so... <laughs> Alright, so this is a new product also going in my shop. It is kind of random because I don't usually see this kind of thing. Um, anyway, yeah, so these are the new little ASICS notebooks. So I think off the top of my head they're 48 pages, but I'll um, clarify. Anyway, this is the front of one of them. So this is another drawing from the 30 day challenge that I did. Uh, on the inside, it's just this cute polka dot. What? Polka dot design. <laughs> uh, in the top it says this book belongs to, so you can write your little name in it. Uh, the back inside cover matches, it's also polka dot. And I left the pages blank because you could I could have chosen between lined, dotted, blank. I think that was all of them. And I picked blank just because as a as an artist, I guess. I still find it weird calling myself that. But I find it really handy to have just little blank things so I can scribble down ideas and sketches and just things like that um, yeah but let me know if you want me to release some in with lines or with dots or whatever so that's the first design uh, it says on the book no offense to myself or anything but what the F am I actually doing <laughs> I just feel like that's so relatable to so many, so many people Alright, so the next one, ooh, it's so cute. Okay, so this is my flower head illustration and at the top above your head it says all my secrets. I just thought it would be very cute to add that. So this is the original drawing and it doesn't have the writing, but I added the writing just because it's a cute little notebook and why not. Ah, oh, that's right. So the inside cover, these flowers are part of a quote I drew in the 30 day challenge. It also has this book belongs to. Hi Pickle. I don't know if you can see her, but she's trying to join me. Wait. 
You want to jump up? Yeah. Here you go. Are you going to come up and knock all my stuff down? Come on. Pickle's getting a lot better. We still haven't had the surgery, but she is making progress. She used to just hide under the bed and be scared of anyone and anything and every little noise and everything. But now she's she used to just stay under the bed. She would never ever leave my room, but now she's like roaming the house, sniffing around, going in the kids' rooms. So she's very... What's the word? Curious. She's trying to get up here, but the blind's in the way. Come on. Come on. Come on. Are you coming? <laughs> yeah, so the inside, it has the flowers from the illustration. And then the back cover is the flowers again, but they're like a repeated pattern. And on the back, it has... With love, we'll need to my normal stamp that I put on the back of my prints and then just my website. That's the second design. The next design, I actually drew this for my entry, not entry, but like it wasn't a competition, but it was just something I did for fun because I saw it on Instagram and it was for a magazine that I've loved for years. So this was my hashtag, my Frankie cover um, illustration that I did. And I haven't made it a print yet. Let me know if you want it. Do you mind? She's just standing in the box. <laughs> um, let me know if you want it in a print form, but this is a notebook form. And the inside cover has got the polka dots again because it matches the wall from the drawing and yeah this book belongs to and all the blank pages okay yeah so that's why I thought I had more designs in the greetings cards I forgot I only did three greetings cards and I th I'm pretty sure I did five notebook designs let me just find them Ah yes, so I also did the busy doing nothing in the notebook form because I just thought it was fitting, it's really cute. The back of this is really cute, I made it pink so the front is kind of like a soft peachy colour and then the back is pink and then the inside, ah, it's got the little hearts that are on her clothes and it's also got this book belongs to and the inside of the back cover is also the matching little hats. That one's so cute. What was the last one? So that's four. Is he doing nothing? Ah yes. And then I have the Self Love Club notebook and it says Queen XO. That was my original drawing for my 30 day challenge. And the inside is also the polka dots. I thought it looked cute because it matches her black and white jeans. And I think that's it. Yeah, I got greetings cards, I got notebooks, some new vinyl stickers, some thank you stickers to replace the ones that I've run out of. And that's all of my things for today. <laughs> oh, I hope you enjoyed that. That was really fun. Let me know if you want me to unbox all my products um, on camera. Oh yeah, also, so this is another new thing at the moment. This is the Cura t-shirt. I have a little uh, shipment on the way of a few of them. But I have just ordered a very, very small amount because I'm still very early days. Uh, I still don't have a lot of money to do a lot of things. So I'm just, you know, slowly working with what I have and building as I go. So just to let you know, these at the moment, um, they're being printed on demand. So what that means is when you make an order, then I will get it produced and sent 
to you because I don't have the money at the moment to make like a big bulk order of all these different designs that I want on clothes so it's taking about two to three weeks to go from once you make your initial order um, production and then shipping and getting to your doorstep so if you don't mind waiting you know a little bit longer than usual for them then that's how I'm doing things at the moment just until I don't have to do it anymore yeah I hope that makes sense um, so there's this the Kia t-shirt and there's what do I have on my I think I have five on my website at the moment there's the mama and the papa hoodies there's the mama t-shirt there's this t-shirt and there's the self love club hoodie so I think I might just cap it there at the moment I can literally add every single design I have to my website in clothes but it's just a bit much to deal with at the moment I'll just start small and grow with what I can handle because yeah, at the moment I'm just kind of all over the place. <laughs> um, that's it for this video. If you have any requests of what you want me to film, just let me know. Because I am still just starting out. I still am figuring out what you guys like to watch and what is realistic for me to film. And yeah, we'll go from there. It's early days, so I'm excited to see what's to come <laughs> thank you so much for watching uh my website is winnieter.com if you want to have a look at all of these things maybe purchase something uh follow me on instagram if you want to i have a mum account but i've kind of neglected it because i'm just focusing on work at the moment uh so that'll all be down in the description and yeah thank you so much for watching thank you for all your support love you guys and i'll see you in my next video bye